next guest caught our attention because of their mission to make the next delicious chicken sandwich but on a new level. And while they're also using climate smart practices to grow the chicken. So here to tell us all about what Mount Joy is about is Dion Himmelfarb. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. You know, as we were me. talking earlier, you said, you know, we're, we're coming into a saturated market, but we're doing things a little bit differently. Yes. So first of all, tell, we're making today your fried chicken, right? Correct. So what we're doing today, we're gonna make our fried chicken and um, over here, as you could see, is what What's they what they look like. What, what we get done with, which is done with. a beast of a sandwich. Y'all know that I try everything we make. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get into that, but we'll see in just a minute. So first, it will be good. how do we get started? Okay, so um, we are lucky our chicken is, it's pasture raised chicken. Mm -hmm. It moves to a different uh, a fresh grass every day. Uh, it's got a really diverse diet and it's got exercise every day. So our chicken fresh is grass every, every day. day. So it's happy chicken. Happy chicken. And you can uh, taste the difference. Absolutely. And I think we are lucky so we don't really have to do a whole lot with the chicken. But okay. for this, the way we make our sandwiches, we just want to make sure the so you put it in spiced flour I, first. We put in our own blend, and then we put we double dip Ooh, it. Ooh, double and, dip it. Yes. And this is just enough to give our chicken Ooh. a flavor. Can right? I ask you what is in, I mean, maybe it's proprietary, but what is in the buttermilk mixture? Because it's not just egg. It looks like there's more to it. Yes, we put a little bit of our spices mm -hmm. and, uh, yeah, and some eggs. And speaking of eggs, Actually, pasture-raised chicken eggs and regular eggs will really make a difference if you'll see on this one right here. Okay. This is our pasture-raised chicken. One of our co-founders, Grant okay. Jones, is also, uh, he owns a farmer in okay. Shelton. And this is a regular commercial egg, so you could see the oh, difference wow. in, in, you really can. in the this color. This one's much more orange in yes. color, yes. richer. This one's less. You so, know what, and no this one's is ever done that for me before. <laughs> my grandma always trying to buy the brown eggs, and I'm like, why you gotta buy the brown? Now I understand. Now you know, and this is why it gets that little bit of yellow golden color, color, golden color. Oh. It's from this eggs right here. All right, well now I've learned something other than just frying chicken. Yes. So when you were making, I, I noticed that these sandwiches were already huge, but you actually put a full chicken breast in there. So yes. you're getting a you're getting a mouthful when you get one of these sandwiches, yes. right? So over here I prepare you. Um, so. At Mount Joy, we serve both dark and white chicken, which is very rare. Yeah, it is rare. Um, and people are really interested to when they hear about dark meat, the yeah. thigh. Yeah. So right here, uh, okay. this is how we actually prepare our chicken. Mm -hmm. We work uh, really closely with Rand's Bakery. Uh, we make our own bun with them. So oh, you this commissioned is, your own bun from France. Yes, I didn't even know you could. That is cool. So yeah, this is this is uh, what we call it a hybrid brioche. We want it to be slightly so soft. We want it to be slightly sweetened, but not so much like Hawaiian bun. Okay. But we also want it to be like as beautiful as brioche as you could see the brown It's a beautiful color. bun, nice and spongy too. Yeah. I love that. So this is our bun, and okay. how we make ours is essentially we have two flavors. We have the dark, and we also have a regular flavor. Okay. And so then, this is what this is a cool device. What the heck is this? <laughs> wow. Well, Can I try it? I want to yeah, do it. I want to do it. Oh, the, I gotta get me one of these, Dion. Wow, that's I'll get fun. a couple, so. Whoo, that thing is cool. Now everybody wants to do sauces, right? I do, what is, okay, I gotta try the sauce too. This is habanero, smoke honey habanero. Mm, oh my gosh. Is that good? That is good, Woo, it has a kick too, I like it. So with this, uh, we make our own pickles. Well, we don't make our fresh produce yet. Yes, but, um, but I have no doubt that you eventually will start growing it somewhere. That's the plan. Okay. Um, so essentially we put the tomatoes, we got the fried chicken, and we have our own I love a pickle. house made pickles. And I'll put Can you order extra pickles on the side? Absolutely. Because I do love me Oops. an extra pickle. I actually do it the opposite. <laughs> That's okay. Well. <laughs> That's an upside, now that's perfect. Well, it's still good, right? It is good, okay. All right, like I said before, I don't think I'm gonna be able to dive into this thing, so I'm gonna cut a little piece of the chicken yes. off because I wanna try it. Um, it's hot. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Did you like it? That is really, really, really good. Yes. What is in the spices? Well, you have to try and come to our pop-up okay. this weekend. <laughs> that is, oh my goodness. Okay, that is really good. That's good. 
all right, I love it. I'm in love. Everyone always sees me, they're like, hey, do you like everything? No, I don't, I don't. <laughs> but everybody we have on here is so incredible that I'm not, I'm not surprised that this is amazing. All right, I'm gonna have one more piece. When you tell me, what is Please this pop-up about? Tell me about so, the pop-up. We will have our pop-up this weekend. We will have, as you could see, um, mm -hmm. we make our own uh, hand-cut fries. Oh. Uh, that is also using a potato grown in Washington State. They stay crispy. And what you're having right there, right there is oh, a yeah. sriracha mayo. This is the sriracha mayo. Yes. That you can dip in it, right? Yes. All right, here, let me try this. And we have four other or five total uh, sauces. To Dipping go, sauces? Yep, yeah, to go with our French fries. We also have a mushroom sandwich for those who are vegetarian, but yeah. I would suggest to eat our fried chicken, of course. I love a mushroom sandwich too, though. That's really good too. Okay. Uh, so where where can people come and try Mount Joy? You have a pop up coming up. Tell we us where a, that is. So the pop up is gonna be at Rioni 13. It's one of uh, Ethan Stowell restaurants in Capitol Hill. Okay. And it's gonna be from Friday through Saturday this oh no Friday through Sunday this weekend. Uh, Saturday from four to nine, and then Saturday Sunday from nine to no from eleven to nine. Okay. And then we will have also uh, our own uh, milkshake. We have four different flavors. What is that? Is green? Why is that a green milkshake? Well, it just for fun. It just happened like this weekend is a St. Patty's I'm weekend. Try it. Please do. Okay. It's a uh, matcha mint with mm. uh, our own Oreo cookie crumble. Ooh. Do you like that? Yes, I do like that. <laughs> So that's I've never had matcha, matcha mint. mint. I love mint. Yeah, so we, we thought it would be fun just to have the color. And that one I brought to you is our newest, uh, we call it uh, Mexican flavor, because I just came back from Mexico and I wow. thought. Is it horchata? Well, pretty close, but this is actually, we make our own blend of Mexican chocolate which has little spices to it. Oh yeah, it's chocolate, but there is that kind of horchata cinnamon -y. Yes, yes. I gotta, I gotta say, Dion, everything here, it's it's all the comfort food that we know when we go, but it's it's definitely next level. Yes. The spices, the flavor, the freshness. Yes. Thank you so much of for course. sharing this with of us. Of course. Oh my gosh. Of course. So let's just give everyone a reminder, the next Mount Joy pop-up is happening at Rion 13 on Seattle's Capitol Hill from March 17th through the 19th. She gave you the, the, the hours, but just go check it out, because let me tell you, you're not gonna regret it. All right, thank you so much. Thank you, oh, appreciate my goodness. it. Those are good. <laughs> appreciate it. All right, well, it's always nice